everybody, it's Danielle and today we're going to install a wheel on my gate. Okay, today I'm going to talk about how to put a wheel on a gate. We have the wire mesh gates because we have goats as well as horses and sheep and they will get through if we're not careful. So here's the gate wheel and it is for the 1 and 5 8 inch to 2 inch round tube gates and these are the brackets it comes with and um, this is the wheel. Now note that the wheel is gonna take up a little bit of space, so you're gonna need to space your gates so that there's room for it. Um, and you see we have one of these brackets here um, for closing it. Okay. So they give you these pieces here. These are shims if this, doesn't, if this piece doesn't fit close enough to your gate, so you put them in like this. We don't need these, but in case you do, that's how they work. Um, so go ahead. Okay, so the bottom is the one closer to the axle. So you can go ahead, seeing this has got nothing, we can just slip it in. You can just uh, put that one through to start with and lift up the gate and pop it on like that. And all you have to do for the top one is put this through and use a socket to tighten it once you have screwed through here. I'd probably recommend putting the bolt on the side that has the least amount of mud in case it comes off. But we're setting this um, up before we do the height on the opposite side. Um, obviously this was a gate that was hung before, so we're actually moving the hinges to work with the width of our gate now because this adds extra width to our gate that we didn't have there before. Let's just leave that. That's, we can tighten that more later. But that's all there is to it. I'm not going to go into the hinges because that's kind of a separate post and something else to look at. But that is the wheel. That's how it goes on. I'll show you what it looks like when we're done. Okay, so this is how it opens and closes. It's not perfect in and out because we would have had to move some posts to do it. Um, we'll do it a little bit better for the other gate we're installing. But um, yeah, for this one, we had a pre-existing gate we're trying to work around. But it opens both directions and the wheel will make it less likely to pull on this post here. Um, although it is braced, but yeah. Overall, it just makes things a little easier. I uh, hope this was helpful. Take care. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and check out my blog, DIY Danielle. Have a great day.